and welcome to the NBS Show, episode number 335. I think it's been a while since we did this and I haven't really done the show notes yet. So I'm going to assume it's 335 because strangeness. So anyway, uh, on today's episode, I am joined by Silverquill. Hello, all you fine bronies and Pegasus sisters. How are you doing, man? Oh, I'm doing well. It's It's been a uh, full year. Very full year. And also joining us today is Tara. Hello. Hey there, man. How are you doing? I'm doing pretty good. I've been waiting for a year for this day to happen. <laughs> nice. So, anyway, um, I'm getting right into it. Today, there's no news because, well, this episode will come out on New Year's Day. So, yay, Happy New Year's. And... Like any other New Year episode, we're just going to talk about what are we looking forward to for the New Year's. Something quick and simple. So, um, Silver, what what about you, man? Like, what's your year going to be like? Here's a funny story. Well, on Twitter yesterday, I saw uh, someone had posted a collection of screenshots of everyone saying from 27, 2007 onward, uh, this year was terrible. Let's hope next one is better. Next post. Oh, this year was the pits. Let's hope the next one doesn't isn't as bad. Oh, this year was so terrible. Let's hope that the, the next one can offer me some hope. And on and on it goes. The message being, oh, optimism for the future is a bad thing. <laughs> How do you function that way? I mean, okay, no, no year is ever going to reach the ideal of everything went our way perfectly, splendidly, no problem. But I'd rather look forward to it and just tackle what comes than fear each new day. So I'm looking forward to the new year. I don't know what it might hold. I don't know what developments or surprises are in store, but I'm going to try and make the most of all of it. Uh, in particular, I will look forward to uh, conventions and the chance to meet fellow fans face to face and with a mixed feeling, the final BronyCon. That's going to be big. Like, I-, I don't think I'm able to attend that one due to financial issues. I know the patrons there, but the patrons not really going to help me with the flight ticket, the food, and also the visa that I need to pay. So, yeah. Oh, it would have been nice to see you there. I know, I know. Probably one day. So there will be other other conventions, other opportunities. Exactly. True, true. true. And Tara, what about yourself? Well, I am very excited for the New Year's. There's a lot of good movies I can't wait to see, like How to Train Your Dragon 3 looks interesting. I also can't wait to see Godzilla 2 King of the Monsters. I'm looking forward to that. And I can't wait to also attend BronyCon since it's the last year. My first year of BronyCon was last year. I missed 2018, so I'm going again next year. And like Silver said earlier, too, that... Again, you know, people are saying, let's hope this year is the better one because a lot of people are saying, oh, 2018 is the worst. We lost a few great actors. A lot of this stuff's happening. Like, but that's life. We come and we go. Some, some people's lives just, uh, gone away. I mean, I'm not saying that was a bad thing, but it's, these things just happen with old age. Mm-hmm. It's a circle of life, if they say. Exactly. And, uh, and during 2018, I finally was able to see Citizen Kane. Yay. Yes, well done. <laughs> you've got you've got the one up on Safi there. <laughs> Eat <Yay>. that Safi. <laughs> oh, well. And as for me, as for my New Year's thing, well, um starting the new year with a cold and a sickness and whatnot is not fun. Um even though this is recorded on December twenty ninth. So yeah. <laughs> um Starting off not feeling too well is not great. But hey, um, I'm always positive. Uh, 2019 is going to be awesome. Uh, for us PlayStation 4 owners, Resident Evil 2 Remake is coming out in January. And in March, Devil May Cry 5. So yay. Um, on top of that, like Tara mentioned, uh, Kaiba's Training Dragon sequel is coming out. So yay. What else? New ponies, I hope. So yay. And yeah, I think that's about it in terms of personal. And as for the show... Um, <clears throat> we're gonna do a lot like we have things planned um, Patreon subscribers what you call this uh, Patreon thing that we need to uphold and whatnot and yeah like next year is going to be something interesting and talking about next year and with the review show and well review and discussion podcast um, we're proud to present to you Tara he's gonna be a staple on the podcast 
and I hope you guys could welcome him as you welcome us. Yay! Yay! And it'll be interesting to see how Terra reacts to some of Silver's questionable jokes. Me? <laughs> questionable jokes? Yes. Why, Norman, I do declare, what are you going on about? Mm, I don't know, maybe something with the newer reviews that may come out? <laughs> well, we don't know what will happen in the new year. I, I guess it depends how much will he react to things like, Wee! <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, Terrell, you got another assignment. Go watch Kung Pao enter the fist. Oh. Really, it's, it's, a, it's a goal for every MBS uh, review to get Norman to giggle uncontrollably. <laughs> uh, yes. Well, we did do that last time on the best gift ever. Oh. Which is which was meant a success. <laughs> Yay. But then we so, broke his dreams too at it. <laughs> my dreams were not broken, I think. Oh no, I think your dreams were broken. Uh, we broke your dreams on that one uh, best gift ever short with Applejack, and you thought that she did all those voices, but then the credits reveal the truth. Oh, I'm salty. <laughs> she, she sits on an apple throne of lies. Uh, I'm salty. But hey, um... Much of a shorter show than usual. And hey, um, I would love to go on and on about what we're going to do and stuff. But Silver here has other obligations to do. And I'm thankful for him to spend as much time as is possible. And thank you, Tara, for getting up early and doing this. No problem. I've enjoyed being a part of the NBA show. And we'll look forward to doing more reviews. And being thoroughly bizarre. And I'm sure... Somewhere, somehow, we'll have another mirac- miraculous review. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Th- that is on the board, too. Oh, I don't know if could... I should be nervous or excited. <laughs> have you seen the well, miraculous review? Well, a lot of me going, You're sick! You're sick! Have, have, you s- <laughs> have you seen the uh, miraculous ladybug? Uh, from time to time. Ah, so we have a casual watcher here. That's going to be interesting. <laughs> Err, no, a filthy casual. <laughs> hey, at oh least I God. saw Home Alone in Star Wars. <laughs> yeah, you are definitely ahead of Safi. <laughs> yeah, I'm throwing the punches here. Although if she, when she probably listens to this, she's gonna probably get that master ball ready. No, oh, no. Uh, but still, Norman, you're my shield. No, wait, no, Silver's my shield. <laughs> oh, none can capture me. <laughs> I'm a free spirit. That is gonna be something. <laughs> So anyway, uh, let's see here. If you have any questions, concerns, or suggestions for the show, you can contact us at com, And you can also reach us on the Twitters. The show's Twitter account is at the Show, And my personal Twitter account is at Norman Sanzo. And Silver, where can the good people find you? Well, you can find me on the Twitters under MLP Silver Quill. Same for DeviantArt, where you can find my online gallery, including title cards to my videos. Videos that will lead you back to YouTube. Just do a search for Silver Quill or After the Fact. And every Wednesday, you can find me on Equestria Daily, posting a comic review or editorial. And do check out the uh, EQD posts, because those are always good tips to find out when the comics are out, and also if it's worth a read or not. I will say this for 2018. I thought, uh, I don't think there was any truly bad comics. There were Some made more impact than others, but good year for the IDW comics. Hmm. Not that you mention it. Yeah, there's no stinkers this year. I think what this year was playing it so safe. Eh, playing it safe, but the main ser- but the uh, series like Legends of Magic and Nightmare Nights, those were really well. Yeah, th- those were gems. And also the addition of Pencil Pony, that was awesome. Like having him on the crew, that is something awesome. Well, there you go. Yep, yep. And also Terra, where can the good people find you? Well, as is obvious, people can find me on YouTube, but they can also find me on my Twitter and Facebook and DeviantArt. Just do one simple search of Torterra1324, and that's where you will find me. Just awesome. don't catch me. <laughs> awesome, awesome, awesome. And also, please subscribe and rate us on iTunes, YouTube, and don't forget to press the bell icon to stay up to date, and also Stitcher Radio, and also like our Facebook page. You can catch us on com. Links are in the show notes. Also, do subscribe to the Review and Discussion Podcast on iTunes and Stitcher Radio. Over there, you'll catch, well, us reviewing Pony Comics, Pony Episodes, and Pony Movies. And yeah, it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. 
So anyway, if you'd like to support the show, you can do so at patreon.com. With every support, you'll get a week's early access to the review and discussion podcast, exclusive and deleted content. And a huge thank you from me. Talking about thank yous, I'd like to thank myself like Amy, Charles, Lucky Knight, Tristan, Starstream, Cat, and also Jeffrey. Thank you so much, guys. You guys have been awesome. And hey, we, we got a sappy. Hey, sappy. Oh, I just came in here for a little bit to check on you guys. I'm still at vacation. How's vacation? Let me guess. You guys are recording. Yes. Kind of, yes. But it's near the end. Okay, then I'll leave. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. 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 And that was Asapi. You can find her on the YouTube and on the DeviantArt, on the Anime Christie. So, yay. <laughs> so, anyway, um, did I say I was Storm Sanzo? Uh, I think you did. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, I am the Silver Quill. And I am the Torterra. And we'll guys catch you next week with another fun episode of the MTS Show. See ya. Adios. Bye. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year.